hey guys welcome or welcome back to my youtube channel it's a girl tracy patrick's and in today's video guys i'm going to be showing you guys my hair wash routine my hair care routine after putting my hair in protective styling for three whole months so as you can see i'm just taking out the braids i made last night because i didn't want my i, I don't want to go to bed with my hair out like that so i'm just trying to you know loosen the hair as you can see i'm going to be going in with my olive oil because i don't want my hair drying out or anything and this olive oil is almost finished so i'm just going to use everything on my hair today So I'm just going to go ahead and massage the oil into my hair and make sure it touches every single corner of my hair. So this shampoo I call from a friend that makes shampoos and hair conditioners but i've already used other fits and this is the only thing remaining but this is a step aren't we first of all we're going to dredge my hair in water like make sure my hair is saturated in water okay <laughs> i really really hate putting on clothes in the shower it's so annoying but like i have to do it for this video right oh jesus christ not me feeling sexy in the shower. <laughs> hey, God. I was pleasantly surprised when I found out my hair wasn't even dirty. Like, Look at this hair, look at the foam. The foam is even still white, you know. And I had to get into every nook and cranny of my hair. Like, if you want to wash your hair, make sure you like you dig your fingers into your scalp and wash everything out, okay? So for the very next step, I go ahead and rinse out my hair. I rinse out the shampoo from my hair. And if your hair is like really, really dirty, you need to shampoo your hair twice. Like after washing the first time, rinse it out, wash again, and rinse it out. Okay. I almost died. <laughs> After rinsing out the shampoo, my hair is now all clean. And for the very next step, you guys, I'm going in with my Mega Growth Deep Conditioner. And before this step, if you use a hair mask, you can use that before this step. But I'm yet to find a hair mask that suits my kind of hair. Okay? So I'm going to go in with a very generous amount of deep conditioner because I don't joke with my hair, okay? I don't joke with my hair. Yeah. As you can see, I'm going in for more because I felt that the first one I, I took wasn't enough for my hair, so I took extra to add to my hair. I'm putting this conditioner in my hair thoroughly because I need to make sure that I deep condition the entire strands. So, after 
after deep conditioning my hair i just go in with a comb to detangle my hair and as you can see it's like very hard for me to comb up my, my hair because i have like some undergrowths that i need to relax but i said that i'll be relaxing my hair every six months that is like twice in a year so i won't damage my hair okay really making sure my hair gets all the love it needs yeah and i'm going to be leaving this on for like 10 minutes and then i'll be back to wash it out after the 10 minutes are up i just go ahead and comb out my hair and then put it into sections guys i lost the clip where i rinsed out my hair from the deep conditioner but the, the next step is putting in my mega growth leave-in conditioner i was supposed to use the egg treatment on my hair on this day but then i didn't know we had run out of eggs so i couldn't do it anymore so i had to make do with what i had and i'm putting the, i'm putting in a lot of leave-in conditioner in my hair because it actually helps my hair and it makes my hair soft and you know Soft, yeah. <laughs> I'm definitely still going in with my olive oil so you know like seal everything in and lock everything in so you guys I just go back in with my comb I start copying on my hair and if you're yet to notice i really have very stubborn hair like very stubborn hair i've added deep conditioner to this hair and i've added living conditioner to this hair but it's still very hard to comb but like like it's not painful to me because i'm i don't know i don't know if i if i'm used to it but like i don't i don't it, like it doesn't hurt when i comb up my hair okay so that you guys that is pretty much what i do to my hair unless um I start a new hair care routine I'm going to update you guys and let you guys know okay so I'm just going to start like you know coming out the hair and then leave it to air dry because I don't want to you know use my blow dryer to dry the hair I'm just going to leave it to air dry okay look at my hair looking all pink my hair is just black like you guys I used to have like very brown hair before I cut my hair I used to have brown hair and I started making my hair back again last year so this is like new lens i got since i started making my hair last year and i started getting black hair when i started treating my hair like i started like a hair care routine and then i started having black hair but before i used to have like very brown hair okay <laughs> So this is like all the hair I got from this process. This is the only thing that came out from my roots. 
and yeah that's pretty much it for you for this video i hope you guys enjoyed this video this if you enjoyed this video please be sure to like comment share and subscribe bye